So I've got something really exciting in store for this evening. I was just going to hang cell cameras and put out minerals. But my buddy Logan called me and he wants me to come out with him and check out the elk here in West Virginia. It's really exciting because I've only seen one cow my entire life and that was one that I saw last season when I was spotting stalking whitetail. Um, it's just an awesome opportunity to see these bulls in velvet right now. And I'm really excited so I don't have much time. i got to put these cameras out and we're going to meet up with him. I think it's orange. I actually don't see an ear tag. Yeah, she doesn't have one. No. You're what? I think that's a buck over there. Can you tell? He's back. On the... Se the See him? He's right, right on the edge. Yeah, on the field edge. No, he might be a doe. But this is just unreal. I mean, we haven't even made it to the good spot yet. Oh, I know. We, have, just... we have two elk over here. We have four turkey and possibly a big buck over on the right side. And it, what time is it? Seven. It must like just hit seven. It, it's just now seven o'clock. So I've got a good feeling we're gonna see some bulls tonight, don't you? Really good one. We're gonna see some good bulls. We still got two more spots on the way out there. Oh yeah. So the, the yellow tags are from Arizona, right? Yeah, yellow tags from Arizona. So you'll be able to see the yellow tags in their ears, and those are the bulls that we just got from Arizona. And you see orange tags is from Kentucky. Orange tags are from Kentucky. That's cool. Did you see that deer? Yeah, I can't get a good look on him. I can't either. That's a long way off. Those turkey are staying right there with him though. I know. Can you tell if there's a tom in there? No. No, you can't see I want to say that's a doe. Let's say it is. If she step out into the field, I could tell. But the trees behind her are breaking up if I can see antlers or not. Yeah, I think it's a doe. It's, it's not a big buck if it is. No.
with that bachelor group. I probably shoot every single one of those. <laughs> so the elk activity's really kind of died down. We've only seen those three cows, but as you can see, the buck activity has really picked up. We've seen at least 20 bucks today and a couple of really nice ones. Uh, we're actually, one we're looking at right now is huge. He's got a nice kicker. He's a definitely a mature deer. I mean, it sucks we didn't see any bulls, but this made, this has made the trip worth it. This is, this is awesome. Open the arms. I'm sitting here right now with five bucks in my frame. Like, I mean, this, and I'd say at least two of them are fucking young. Not to mention that eight points on the other side of the hill. That's I guess it's a hundred forty checkpoint. It's huge. Easy. Easy. Wait till they start running and hitting each other, man. Yeah. So we're running out of daylight. Um, I don't think the bulls are going to show themselves today, but what, it's today's Tuesday, right? Yeah. Yeah, today's Tuesday. Uh, I don't go back to Morgantown until Friday night, so if the rain holds off, we'll be back out here filming some more. We'll probably see him. We'll probably see him. Probably. Keyword. Yeah, we can run around and see if we can pick them up, or at least run into them yeah. coming in. All right, we're gonna go one more time, see if we can find these elk. We're running out of camera light, running out of daylight, really, but might as well try.